Come and join me on my reverse aging journey. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, I'm 60 years old, and five years ago, I was in pretty rough shape. It's a story I've told here many times, so if you happen to be a repeat viewer, which most of you won't be because we're no longer reaching uh, the viewership that we used to reach here, and I'll explain why that is in just a moment, but basically... I decided to do everything I could to feel better. I wanted to feel like myself again. So at 55, 56, I made a bunch of changes, including taking some natural supplement ingredients. And I started to get some very good results. And I posted those results. And there was a lot of interest here on YouTube about this topic. And the channel has grown to almost 50,000 subscribers. That happened pretty quickly. It only took two, three years to happen. The last couple of years, we've stagnated because we got into a battle with the FDA. The FDA tried to take the main ingredient that I take called NMN, which is an NAD booster. They tried to take it off the market as a supplement. This didn't happen for safety reasons. This happened because a drug company was trying to take it over and make it an exclusive drug. So we pushed back on that. And what I mean by we is I joined a supplement industry trade organization called Natural Products Association, led by Daniel Fabricant, who used to be at the FDA. As a matter of fact, he used to lead the supplement division at FDA under Obama years ago, and he's since <laughs> switched sides quite a bit. Uh, he's very much in the center, but he doesn't pick one side or another. However, we've had a lot more help from members of the current administration, so we're hoping things change now with people like YouTube who are suppressing information about people's health. Now, how do I know that? How do I know that they're suppressing? And how do I know people are even interested? Maybe people just aren't watching the channel anymore because they're not interested in, in hearing about health stories. But I have data and I have reports that say that is absolutely not the case. Matter of fact, I asked ChatGPT, what our viewers are interested in, what resonates. And specifically, ChatGPT came back and said that people want to hear firsthand accounts from others who have experimented or are finding methods that work for them. They have way more trust in people expressing their firsthand accounts and hearing from others than they do the medical profession. So it's very clear why this channel was exploding in growth the first couple of years. But as soon as I went to Washington with Natural Products Association and tried to push back on what FDA was trying to do, suddenly my traffic was reduced at first by over 98%. And right now we're only reaching organically a couple hundred people. We used to reach 20, 30, 100,000 people for some of the videos, and we no longer reach anyone ever since YouTube put NMN on a restricted list even though it was never technically restricted or openly or publicly restricted by FDA. And we also have evidence of that. It was put on a list by LegitScript. However, Natural Products Association sued the FDA last summer and got a judge to put a stay on any action against NMN. Yet, YouTube is still restricting information about NMN, even though this database company, LegitScript, has said that they have informed Google that NMN is not a restricted ingredient. It is not on their list. YouTube still sends information out that it's being restricted and that it's on this list by LegitScript. I can't even believe it. I've tried to write to YouTube and say, look, NMN is no longer restricted. Here's the information. Here's the contact of the general counsel at LegitScript. Here's the contact for Dan Fabricant, who can confirm that a judge has put a stay on this, yet Google won't respond. So it's very interesting. You have to wonder who's controlling what Google censors. Why are they censoring this content specifically? So I'm asking you to join me, and we're going to boost this content and see if YouTube will approve this advertising, which oftentimes they don't, but we're gonna try. I just wanted to explain exactly what's going on, why you're seeing this as technically as an ad, and what we're trying to do here. You can look and you could see our subscribers. You can look at past videos. You could see the traffic and you can see, more importantly, the kinds of comments that people have made in the past. If you don't believe me, believe the people who commented their own results on their own anti-aging or reverse aging journey. People are getting results and it's my belief that this is putting fear into 
the medical industry and big pharma. I think they're afraid of supplements, natural ingredients like NMN, because they're so powerful that people are reporting, many, many people are reporting that they no longer need to take medication. I myself no longer take any pharmaceuticals. I'm completely off medication. I'm much healthier than I've been since I was in my 20s and 30s. I'm physically active. I have loads of energy and focus. And this all came after I started my own protocol. My protocol is in the description. I do get my supplements from Do Not Age. However, that's not really financially motivated. They support the channel if you use my code PULSE. They do support the channel a couple percentage points. However, I am with them, not for money reasons. I can tell you when the channel was growing, I was given offers for much more money by many companies almost daily, and I refused all of them. Why did I do that? Because this is the protocol I adopted. This is the protocol I've had results with, and this is the protocol I share with people, period. That's why I've done it. If you want to use the code like over 10,000 other people have done so far, use the code the Pulse or just Pulse. Make it easy. They've added that recently. That's how you do that. Or not. Just follow the content. I'm not even asking you to go up there and get supplements. That's not what I'm doing today. I'm asking you to come join me on this journey and sharing of information. How can you do that? You can subscribe to nadboosterclub.com. You can go up there and subscribe. You scroll down a little bit, fill in your email. We'll contact you when we're on X and Rumble, where we're going to be going because we need to go somewhere that isn't censored. Uh, already I'm on TikTok. That's somewhat censored, but it's not bad. It's pretty good. Uh, we hope it doesn't go away. Uh, Instagram, totally censored. They don't allow talking about supplements at all still. Hopefully that changes. There's supposed to be some changes going on at Facebook and Instagram, but they suppress all any posts about supplements or talking about anti-aging. Or if you say anything bad about the drug industry, Facebook blocks that information right away. They slow you down. You don't reach anyone. So it's not only YouTube from my experience. It's other platforms as well. So we're going to be moving to other platforms where we can reach people that actually want the information, hopefully, and not be censored by a platform like this one. So I hope you'll join me. I appreciate you watching to the end, by the way. Uh, I'll be back soon.